currently 634. A new community venture through Connection Point Church in Tippecanoe County Community Corrections is coming to greater love yet. And these targeted efforts include a focus on people housed within the work release building as well as those on house arrest. News 18's Marvin Bills joins us now in studio. Marvin, welcome to the morning team. Thank you, Marley. Good morning to you and good morning to you all at home. Lead pastor for Connection Point Church, Zach Maddox, says this is a great opportunity to bring people together and extend a helping hand during this difficult time. We are, have an opportunity to be able to work with community corrections and offer Bible studies to those who have an interest in scripture. It's called Discovery Bible Studies. It's a new program that has been in the making for many years. And out of that, just talked with some people who had a heart to reach out to those affected by prison and had some connections with community corrections and reached out to them and said, Is, would this be something that would be beneficial to you? Discovery Bible Studies kicked off last weekend at Tippecanoe County Work Release. Executive Director at Tippecanoe County Community Corrections, Jason Huber, says this will create a deep impact on someone's life in recovery. Everybody has a different point in their life as to what they need. Um, uh, no matter what, no matter where you come from, uh, no matter what your background is, um, everybody has a different a different point. Huber adds that the goal of Discovery Bible Studies is to give participants a sense of hope. The world's a heavy place um, right now, and uh, on a lot of different levels. Um, and so, if, if this can provide um, somebody, um, or you know, hopefully a lot of people, um, some comfort and and some guidance and and just some peace within themselves. Um, then, then that means that we're doing our, our part. People interested in leading a, a session can reach out to Connection Point Church. For that information on that and times, visit this story on our website. That's WLFI.com.